things were getting loud at the bar I was sitting at in Thailand, and all I wanted to do was go home. Some my hostel that was because I was solo traveling. All I could think was, this bar scene isn't me. I like to be alone, at home with my cats, preferably in the quiet and in the dark, or with a small group of people that I can relate to, to talk about the deeper things in life, you know? I felt so frustrated. I thought this trip would be a new beginning or would help me to feel better somehow. I bit into the chocolate I grabbed on the way home to eat my feelings. Thank God Thailand had some decent chocolate. And as I chomped into my Hershey bar, I realized something powerful. Since I'd left home to travel, nothing had really changed. I had all the same habits, anxieties, and unhelpful patterns. It seems they had come on vacation with me too, though I didn't recall inviting them along. But no new place was going to change things that were within me. I had been dealing with the impact of a long-term relationship ending and burning out in my career. I was depressed, anxious, and even suicidal. And truthfully, I felt like my family and those around me would be better off without me. You see, I'd grown up in a broken home, traveling back and forth between two parents, and as a result, I'd felt broken alone, and never enough. I didn't know what to do. Nothing I had tried thus far had worked. Not therapy, medication, or meditation. So what was left? I knew that I needed and wanted to change. My intention for my trip had been to do journaling, self-reflection, and really focus on taking care of myself. I wanted answers before going home. So despite it not being in the plans, I went where any person in search of healing goes, to Bali. Anyone seen Eat, Pray, Love? <laughs> I soon became aware of the pain I'd been carrying for years and how deeply it had been weighing on me. And thus, I started my journey with energy healing, which is a gentle technique and spiritual practice. But let me just put healing in simple terms. I want you to imagine I shook this can repeatedly, and then we're not going to do that. But what would happen if I did? It would explode. And we're not much different as humans. As we go throughout life, we experience many painful things. In order to survive and keep moving forward, we shove those experiences and the emotions attached to them aside. But all of that unresolved pain doesn't just go away. That energy has to go somewhere. This pain shows up when, like the pop can, we explode our emotions at others. This unresolved pain can show up as anxiety, depression, and even physical ailments and disease over time. Energy healing can help us to work through and release that pain and start feeling better. Through doing this healing work, I learned more about myself in one session than I had in years of traditional therapy. I finally started to uncover why I had anxiety and depression, which was much different than the mindset work and temporary relief I'd been experiencing before. I realized that we recreate the patterns and behaviors that we learned growing up, and it's up to us to break that cycle, because the pain we experience is not meant to be the entirety of our life's journey. Doing this healing work has helped me transform my life. If I told my younger self this is the life I'd be living, she never would have believed it was possible. For so long, I thought that I was going to die young because I didn't want to be around. But I've broken the cycle of being in toxic relationships, allowing me to meet my incredible partner and just connect so much deeper with those people around me. I've left a draining career in the mental health field, found my true purpose, and started my journey of becoming an entrepreneur, showing others the life that's waiting for them too. I spent years searching the world for people, places, and things that would make me feel better and enough. I always thought the answers were out there and that I would find peace and empowerment if I just kept searching. Maybe you felt that way too. The truth is, personal power is forged over time. We're taught to run away from the experiences that hurt us, yet wisdom is found in those experiences, wisdom to help us move forward. True empowerment grows as we begin to view life from beyond the lens of our pain. So, when we find ourselves searching for a way out of the mess that we may feel, let us remember that the peace and answers we long for 
are right here within us all. As Glinda from The Wizard of Oz said, you had the answers all along, my dear. You just had to learn it for yourself. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you.